If you have a hot water heater that is fueled by gas, we need to explain how this mechanism works. Here at the top is a knob that has three settings that align with the little tab right there. On, that would be in the normal setting. Pilot, we'll show that in a moment, and off. If you were to come home and have lukewarm or cold water in your hot water heater, it's probably because the pilot light went out during the day. And so you want to set this to off for a few minutes, let any gas in the area dissipate. Then turn this to where it says pilot. You'll know it's in the right position because you'll be able to push that button down. Uh, that simply aligns up with this cutout here. And the important thing is you push that button down and then spark it like that there. The days when you had to remove that cover and hold a match in there are long past. You simply hold the button down and spark it. And then here's the most important part. You continue to hold that button down for about 60 seconds. When you've done it long enough, let this go, turn this to on, and you should hear the burner come on. And that's when the water will start to heat. If that doesn't work, if you don't hear the burner come on, what you should do is go back and redo this step and hold this down even longer. What's going on here is, it, when the pilot light goes off, the supply of gas to the pilot light must go off as well. Otherwise, your house will fill with gas. When the pilot light is on, what happens is that the little pilot light heats what's called a thermocouple that is above it. And when the thermocouple is warm, it allows the supply of gas to the pilot light to stay on. This overrides the thermocouple, keeps that line open long enough for the pilot light to reheat the thermocouple. And if you release this before the thermocouple is warm enough, the supply will cut off and the pilot will go out. So this override, you simply need to do it long enough so that the thermocouple will leave the supply on after you let that button up. If your hot water heater is gas fired, you will have a supply coming out of the wall and a flexible hose connection to the burner mechanism. And this here is simply the shutoff valve. Uh, valves like this one, when they are crosswise to the pipe, that means the flow of gas is off. And when it's lined up with the flow of the pipe, that means the gas is on.